we are growing and we're definitely coming for global domination. Uh, thanks so much. Uh, my name is Douglas Sogeto. I'm so happy to be here and looking forward to sharing more about this. Uh, it's definitely growing. Um, when you look at video games, um, there are over 500 you know, developers across the continent, and this is growing uh, you know, by the month. Um, if, you, if you look at the arts, you know, with things like comic, we do have a very um, passionate, very skilled um, comic artist. Um, if you look at uh, esports, you know, on, on the playing side, uh, we do have a very vibrant ecosystem. Africa is a, is a continent of 50, 54 nations. I say right now we are a connected continent. You know, players know each other despite you know the distances, despite differences in languages. And what we are looking at now is you know how do we take this uh, beyond Africa? Um, the good thing is Africa understands its skills. Africa does understand its challenges. Uh, but nevertheless, uh, looking at what it can do. Um, these are the, you know, uh, compared to what people think uh, is happening on the continent. So I think um, where we're at now is that we're connected and we're all moving uh, in one direction. I think culturally, um, we do um, know our values, we do know um, what Africa is all about. It's not really about distinguishing, but see, um, knowing what we bring to the table um, in terms of values, in terms of uh, content, you know, richness of content. Um, I think uh, within the video games, uh, what people are actually looking to this continent is, you know, can Africa bring the next, uh, you know, GTA game? <clears throat> you know, for, for sure there are challenges, um, but I think, you know, if you put that aside, um, it's, you know, within the next three years, um, in my opinion, um, people will be able to play a global, you know, console game, for example, uh, that has come out uh, on the African continent. Uh, for now, esports is still a new thing on the continent, uh, but for sure, as we move along, uh, we'll be able to see the shift um, and see the ecosystem, uh, you know, growing and then partnering uh, together. Uh, we have the, um, you know, the biggest uh, population when it comes to youth. Uh, we do have uh, disposable income, and we're looking to see, you know, how can we partner and collaborate with uh, more companies that are out there um, for, you know, return on investment. So, you know, we're looking beyond charity, we're looking for business, and we are open.